Hello, dear colleagues. My name is Camila dos Santos, and it's a pleasure to be with you from Brazil, especially to share some of my master's researches. I apologize for my rust English, but I'll do my best for our communication. So starting my speech, I am master in visual poetics from the postgraduate program in visual arts at the Federal University of Santa Maria, Brazil, under the supervision of the PhD Andrea Machado Oliveira. My research, which has the same title as this presentation, is called Communication Action Zones in Art and Technology. In Portuguese, Zonas de Ações Comunicacionais in Arte e Tecnologia. Zakat. The keywords used are contemporary art, art and technology, art activism, art and communication, and device. This artistic and academic work was carried out before and during the pandemic of the SARS-CoV-2 virus, the new coronavirus with a set of sound and visual poetics based on the investigation of communicational artistic practices of an activist character. Communicational artistic practices were mediated by different types of devices from the most analogous to emerging media at different levels. To support the notion of art and communication, the authors Mario Costa, Fred Foresti, Cristine Mello, and Gisele Begelman were used. The activist character, on the other hand, was mediated above all by questions and agendas on the rise in current Brazilian history in a fluid way with issues such as the environment, gender, body, subjectivity, and memories. As a basis, it was constructed on the experiences of Brazilian collectives from the 1990s to the present. In addition to the reference point of the 1950s with Italian autonomist philosophers such as Giorgio Agamben and Franco Berardi. For those who still don't know, over the past three years, Brazil has suffered severely from public policies aimed at destroying the economy, the environment, education, health, social and labor rights, in addition to the devaluation of the works of artists, researchers and scientists. And I produced my research at this juncture. In 2019, I started my poetic in Santa Maria, state of Rio Grande do Sul, with different strategies and proposals for different in interlocutors in different spaces of the city. Streets, museums, art galleries, university, schools, social networks, space for radio waves with relational and interactive activities with the participating public. Uh, here uh, we have one a photograph of one performance. Uh, called Stone in the Show that I made in the streets of Santa Maria. More uh, photographs. Here the performance and installation, birthday and funeral of Brumadinho. And more 
works uh, here. Uh, I am working with um, a, a artisanal a craft, uh, sorry, a craft radial transmitter that I made and I operate with uh, cell phone. More works. In 2020, before the pandemic, uh, I, I made uh, more works, different kind of works, always with uh, questions about the Brazilian reality, like uh, violence against women, but after uh, COVID-19, um, the last year, as a result of the world scenario uh, presented with the COVID-19 pandemic, the poetic underwent significant transformations and the same happened with the artistic and communicational strategies. I moved from Santa Maria to a naturist community called Clube Naturista Colina do Sol, located in the municipality of Taquara, also in Rio Grande do Sul. In other words, an unfolded space immersed in the wild, a little bit interfered by human action, which provides other forms of listening and connection, as well as other relationships with the body, communication and technology, such as the use of online platforms for virtual re reality to share the work done. Here uh, we have uh, some works. made in the environment with my body performing video video art and in 2021 the the work uh, keep going um, with uh, environment and platform of um, virtual reality as sensor between 2019 and 2021, I experienced performance creation of installations, interactive experiments in audio, video, and face-to-face -face or via virtual net networks in an unfolded poetic, giving visibility to everyday micropolitics uh, with its memories, affections, formalized impulses of life or ephemeral in moments of encounter. The term device based on George Agamben, Michel Foucault, Wilhelm Flusser and Gilbert Simondon was presented as an operative concept of research and also a perception of the relationship between artists, environment, and technologies and social and affective relationships. In general, communication action zones in art and technology, Zakat, resulted in an experience of artistic creation and its consequences in different contexts with different and other audiences and under challenge conditions in terms of a broader historical context. So that was my presentation for you colleagues. Thank you very much for the attention and I wish a great event for all and health. Thank you, thank you, thank you.